All right, so how did it feel to kind of get back in the swing of things today after mm -hmm. after a week off? Um, it was good to get a back in the swing of things. It was a little slow today, but um, I'm going out there to get to work and getting back in um, shape and whatnot, but it was good to get back in shape with the guys and get back to work. With, with Jay Sean gone, I guess, how does that change your role, not just in the scheme, but in the in the position group, in the uh, in the position in our room? It allows me to work on like my weaknesses with the leadership and um, taking the time this spring, you know, give leadership to the young guys and telling them to come on with me, work with me, you know what, and then just, you know, getting better every day, getting that 1% better. And so taking this spring and this year as well, like, you know, take my leadership role and being that leadership role for my young guys. Seems like you've been active in, in that regard talking to guys that's something that you're like consciously trying to think of during practice yeah because i'm not really like a vocal leader i like lead by example so doing something that i'm not really comfortable with is going to help me be the leadership that i should be the leader that i want. what do you think of uh right now yeah what do you like about him so uh i like about how he just come to work every day you know maybe he'll mess up one day but he'll come back to work get right back up and do the next rep and just move He's fast, strong, you just got to trust himself. And I like how you come to practice. And, and Corey's a guy, I think they moved the running back, mostly full-time to full-time. How has he adapted to that? He's had some nice runs out mm -hmm. here for five practices. He's making a huge stride from last year. You know, he was a lot, a little hesitant, you know. He still was trying to get back into the work and stuff. But see him this spring, he's starting to trust his stuff. He's trying to stuff his strength. What have you seen from Trey Benson? You know, it's only been a couple of weeks of him out of here at practice. Seems like he has some nice uh, explosiveness to his Yeah, game. as you can see today, he took like a you know a good 70, 60 yard run. Got explosiveness, he's strong, and um, getting all the ball, getting all the ball. So that's what you get from Trey Benson. Antonio McFeely's a new linebacker. Uh, I don't know if you're able to like directly see what he's been doing, but I've seen him like a lot more. Uh, Active. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. He's one of those guys you gotta keep his eye on, man. Like, you know, one time so like we were doing the inside zone, and he, like I'm thinking the hold is open, he just slipped right through and top of me. So you just gotta keep him out. He's really quick and he's smart, and like he's loads a little bit that like he been through the game, he been through it all, so he know. Have you noticed an improvement on the offensive line? More depth. Have you noticed an improvement on the offensive line? Just with more depth there. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You know, I think the depth. Added the depth with the linemen, it made everybody else better. It made everybody else come together with the chemistry. And like Kaden coming from West Carson, and then he being a vet, he told me he like he went up there, he told me what, what they need to do and what not to do, and their weaknesses and whatnot. And he's just being a leader in that group. And them boys getting them boys getting better every day. That's all I can say. Oh, wow. Love them. Love them. Well, I mean, everybody, I mean, it just makes us get better chemistry-wise. Like, everybody doesn't care, like, who gets the, who the shine. Like, you know, if you see me, I'll be shine, I'll be running down the field with LT or Trey scoring and whatnot. So I just like to support my guys and everybody get their share in the, in the running back room. How do you feel like overall the first practice was being kind of the first time since spring break? I guess like nine days since last practice. It wasn't our best practice, but it was pretty solid. It could have been better. Um, but um, other than that, it was pretty solid. It was solid. You're off for a week. Can you kind of lose a little focus? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, all we, you know, we just come back from spring break and coming back in. A lot of people losing focus and whatnot. But, you know, I tried to come today with a better focus and whatnot. And so was the group, you know. Before practice even started, you know, I had to come up, you know, had to get our minds right because, you know, this practice was one of those, one of those practices that was set up. What are some aspects of, of your game that you're working on this spring, things that you're trying to improve on? Uh, I believe my pass protection and catching the ball out of the backfield. How do you think, it seems like you've had a nice uh, handful of catches so far this spring. And how do you think you're doing in, in that regard? I'm doing better. You know, I can always get better with catching the ball. You know, I dropped a few passes. I think I dropped a few passes today. But, uh, you know, I'm just trying to work on not dropping the pass each day and just getting better with catching and whatnot. What is it you're trying to learn with pass protection? Uh, leverage, hand placement, and, you know, just overall how to use my leverage because you know i'm a smaller guy and whatnot so i'm not really strong and like people that's big back and whatnot so i got to use my leverage and my technique and um as far as spring that's what i'm really focusing on i know he's not in your position group anymore jakai seems to really be standing out with the, the new role receiver full time what have you seen from him what kind of receiver do you think he could be by the time he's done uh 
by the, by, when he's done here, he's gonna be he's gonna be one of the best receivers. He shows like you know his speed. If he can catch, he can run route, and he brought me on a tree. But um, he's getting better than every day. You see flashes of him, and uh, I like what I'm seeing from him. You go, he's going back to that last year, him with it, um, last year, last season. But um, yeah, he's getting better every day.